Hello everyone, my name is Salvador Benitez. I'm the VP of Pellet and Cryo Operations. I've been with Yakima Chief Hops for three years now, uh, my fourth production season. Today we're gonna be giving you a tour of our Sunnyside Pellet Plant and our Cryo Hops facility. We're in front of our, our Sunnyside Gray Line. We're in front of our Bell Breaker. What we do here is we stage our hop bales that come from the farm on this belt and they go through a, a breaking process. As those hops get conveyed over, they go into our hammer mill. This is where we're actually taking that, that hop cone and grinding it to a desired particle size or a desired spec. That ground material is stored on the upper, upper tank of our mix tank. There's some ribbon mixers that homogenize that product. As those hop bales are being homogenized, we're really targeting to provide a consistent hop pellet. We achieve that desired time. That product is dumped onto our augers. At that point there, it's gonna be conveyed over to our, our pellet mill. Feel free to follow me right over here. The pellet mill is a piece of equipment that is converting that ground hop into a T90 pellet that the brewers use in the brew house. During production, our quality control team will take samples and measure density and temperature to ensure we're always providing a quality product. As those T90 hop pellets are coming off the pellet mill, they go into our into a cooler, bring the temperature down prior to packaging. It'll go through our fine shaker to remove any, any loose material or pellet chips. As the pellets get conveyed over, they go through a scale where we achieve our desired weight. That product will go into our vertical form and fill uh, sealer. This concludes our tour of the Type 90 pellet line. Now we're gonna head over to our cryo hops facility. Victor, why don't you come on in and say hello. Victor's our, our plant manager. Hi everybody, uh, Victor Nunez, uh, the plant manager for the cryo facility. Uh, took over for Sal uh, as he was promoted up to VP of pelleting operations. Thank you, Victor. Thank you. Let's continue on. So now we're up on, the th on our third deck where the hops go through a, a cryogenic process and the hops get processed through a, a separation process to achieve you know, our lupulin cryo hops product. Our cryo hops product is our concentrated lupulin pellet, you know, intended to provide intense hop flavor and aromas. The freezing process allows us to, to separate that vegetative material from the lupulin gland. As the, the hops are coming up, this piece of equipment here, they go into our pellet mill. As the uh, lupulin powder is being conveyed into our pellet mill, it'll get introduced into the dye. But I'd really like to bring Victor in to describe this process. Come on, Victor. So this is kind of that area, that surface area where it's coming out of the dye. And as pellets are making their way out, we have a, a sampling program where we're ensuring that we're meeting quality specs for both density and temperature. So we'll continue into the next step of our process. So now we're, we're right below our pellet mill. As the concentrated pellets are making their way into our fine shaker, what we're doing here is we're removing any any fines or any chip pieces out of the system. As the, the pellets come off the fine shaker at this point, you've got a, a product with pure pellets. Those pellets are conveyed over into a, a scale and are going into our packaging process. Here, we're using a vertical form fill and seal process to, to package our cryo hops. These are packaged primarily in a five kg bag or 11 pound bag. They come off our, our bagger and into our packaging line. We want uh, to maintain the utmost quality and we want to ensure that when a brewer opens one of our packages, the hops are the freshest they can be. Thank you for joining us on the on our tour of our cryo facility. COVID has been very challenging. You know, I, I look forward to the day that we can all stand together and give this tour live. Yeah, and uh, as Salvador has mentioned, you know, we, we really wish we, you guys can be out here. Um, just, you know, you guys are more than welcome as brewers to come through, visit the facility, uh, you know, once this whole COVID situation has passed. And we look forward to, to your feedback. Uh, you know, this isn't something we typically do. We're both kind of camera shy. So I hope our first take is the last take. <laughs> <laughs>